listening closely. We doing our own thing, but we doing this for the culture. Check out the top. Check out the top. Don't be the subject. Don't be the subject. We keep it pop. Hey, we keep it pop. You can be up next. You can be up next. We are more than culture. 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 We are more than culture. More than culture. Why do all that? Like and subscribe a lot. Y'all yeah, remember all the shit Let's we had stopped talking about? You gonna start off with what you was gonna talk about? I don't remember. I do. Alright, we'll start now. Let me know. Just kick it out. Right. More than culture is the brand. It's the more than culture show. Woo! Come on, the secret change. Three more rap. Tyler Chronicles. And, you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? Funky town. Oh, hey. What's up, man? What's up, man? Town, Southwest Texas. Hey, Southwest Fort Worth, City Castillo in the building. Yeah, Fort Worth. Riding on Game Theory on hey. HBO. Yeah. Did we say hey. that, though? Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. HBO Max, check me out. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh, them kids bring me ragged today. <laughs> Boy. Oh, shit. They don't pay me enough to watch them kids. You hungry, Tyler? Bro, what is this P-Valley conversation you having, bro? Oh, it's your brains. Sorry. <laughs> it's your brains. <laughs> That's cool, bro. Well, what's been going on with you, man? Hey, man. Getting to work HBO with y'all. shit. cool, man. Work with the fam. Yeah. Come in Atlanta. That's the best time I had in Atlanta. Yeah, say yeah. that. For real? It's the best time I had in Atlanta. That's cool. Before, it just worked as cool. Just like I had a lot of fun while I'm here. You know what I mean? You see, your, your birthday was around the time. Yeah, man. Birthday was cool. Neo That's came right, to bro. his birthday party. Shut up, dog. Neo. <laughs> Neo came. Oh, man. To the B-Day chilling, party. We what the kind of hat he had on? Because <laughs> you know he had one. I don't know. It was cool, though, because he slid over there. <laughs> <laughs> he, was, he looked like a slide. Yeah, yeah, it was cool. I was like, what's up, man? He said, well, he walked. He said, my bad, one second. And he, huh, huh, huh. And then he said, what up? He was cool as hell. Cool as hell. The sound. Yeah. 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 He's a slider. That's <laughs> funny as hell. Uh, shit. But, yeah, man, you've been in Atlanta a few times. This has been fun, I think, because we actually, we actually get a couple days off in between. Yeah. Not just have to deal with that. You know what I mean? Work of it, and it's been fun at work this time. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Real it's been real cool. I like because I like when they all ask Tyler for help. <laughs> oh man, you know let me hear you. Let me Tyler you. got a rapport with him, so it's dope because yeah. I could be sitting right there and they'd be like, Tyler, 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 and I'm not the type that's gonna hate on that. Right? <laughs> so I'll just let it happen. Man, so you can hate on that. Tyler so be like, Sydney's right here, and I'll be like, they love you, bro. <laughs> Keep shining, King. You can hate on that, dog. Shine, King. <laughs> You can have that dog, but but Rima has been the uh, the target of a lot of Sydneyisms. If y'all, if, for those that know Sydney, you know he's fucking super sarcastic. Right? God damn, bro! The whole had to pull me to the side, like, hey man. <laughs> Should, should we go outside? Is he <laughs> fucking with me? Because <laughs> I was like, it, it is a lot. Like I, I've seen him go, but he's really going hard on Rima. <laughs> bro, this nigga was so. We driving to the set. You know what I'm saying? Say that right. We are not. Said it right. All right. I came downstairs thinking I was finna get in the van, and the showrunner is in his Escalade bus car <laughs> in the passenger seat, and I see Remo in the front seat, and I was like, oh, okay, you know, I like to call that job secure. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? Remo taking him to set, so I was like, bet, nigga, this is this how this how you stay in, nigga. But you on your phone like, yo, this is job security I right did, here. I did tell the people, <laughs> if your jokes don't land, maybe you could be a driver. <laughs> <laughs> Working on being more social, man. Like, oh, they be like, shit, is back, leave the show. Oh, I don't have no know. denim on that day. Uh, nah, they be like, shit, I'm still mad. You can be a driver. <laughs> but tell, no. ask Tyler what I said about you the other day. Mm. Go ahead. Oh, for real? Okay, okay. Mom, mom. Talk to him shit. Go ahead, Tyler. What do you say? Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, man. Damn, you didn't say shit. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't make a line like a mother. They call it plays. No, it's yeah. for real. No, it's actually, bro. I'm putting some more than the culture. It's actually what it's called. What? Erica Dutch is there? That's the name of the show. I know. That's a joke, dude. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I picked it up. Ah, now, word is, uh-huh. what I told you before is, People see you working. They always see you, you know, being helpful, being there. A lot of motherfuckers get this job and use it as a as a fun way to kind of fuck off. Correct. You know, smoke and drink and you know, it's a lot of fine women in the back and celebrities and all that. But my man's coming to work, and they, sure. they definitely notice that. So like I said, how uh, RJ noticed it. I told sure, him, I told sure. him, boy, I said, hey, Remo really be working. He said, yeah, I be seeing him a lot. He always around. I said, yeah. He's like, he's always in the face. He's like, hey. And he's like, the driving thing, yeah, cool. Like, make sure he's there tomorrow. <laughs> so, like, I said, okay. Right early. Right early, yeah. Man, I was tired as fuck, too, bro, because it's like about, what, 30, 40 minute drive to set. And I was looking forward to just blacking out for like Chicken 30, back. 40. Yeah, so. And here go this nigga. You got a license? You got a license. You're from hilarious. Georgia? Come on. I was like, this nigga, like, bro, this nigga is featuring for goddamn now. That's what I said. I said, this feel <laughs> no. like a way you open it for a nigga. You got to drive. Yeah, you got a license? Yeah. 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 Come on, we going you, to You have a drove? We going to tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, man. You ain't got, you ain't got, like, y'all get some far trips? Like, if from the hotels. Like, Marlon Wayne's what we're talking about. Y'all. It's like an hour away, drive. But me and him, like, we argue, like, not like brothers, but like brothers, like, nigga, like, you know what I mean? Like, I want the front seat. If we have a driver, I want the front seat. He's like, Sydney, I'm, I see you're not tall. I'm taller than you. I want the front seat. So he's short though. Yeah, but he's, he's shorter than me. <laughs> <laughs> and I love him, but he got to get in the back seat. You know what I mean? You make that yeah. nigga. I don't make him, but sometimes I'll be arguing over the front seat. <laughs> <laughs> one time he cool though. One time I got, we got pulled over. 
and my license was bad, right? He was and, driving? Yeah, and I had a little oh. weed on me. Oh. And he don't smoke. And he was like, shit. And the assistant was like, give me the weed. Right, he gave the weed to the assistant. Cop pulled over. He's like, you have your license? And I leaned back, and he saw Marlon. He's like, Marlon Wayans. And it was good. Yeah. Yeah. I lean back is hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, get out of the car. Yeah. Right. Show this nigga your face. Yeah. Go over like pop, 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 yeah. pop, pop. Do something. Do yeah. your shit, nigga. Do your shit. <laughs> My license, man. Do your shit. Yeah. My brothers. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Under, underrated sitcom. The fucking yeah. brother. oh, man. man's brothers. Underrated. It's still like it's still funny to this day. Right. A lot of sitcoms you go back and watch now as an adult. You're like, oh, okay. That's, you that's one I haven't really hard. went back and watched this one. I haven't really went back and that. that one and Jamie Foxx show. Yeah. The Jamie Foxx show. Bro, was still hilarious, bro. bro. Still get the joke. Still carry. Yeah. Martin, Jamie Foxx. Wayne Brothers. What, what show didn't feel like it carried? Besides uh, Thea. Besides <laughs> Thea. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. That was good. Thea. I can't think if I'd like Thea when it came out. Try to Thea. Man. You know what show didn't hold up? Uh, uh, when, when Bill Cosby and his wife they had their own show. It was, just, it was just them, right? And yeah. Was just, yeah, I was like, yeah. when did this? But happen? It wasn't it was even right after that with Doug. Remember Doug? But it wasn't okay. even them though. Like nah, it, they weren't even the Hustables. They nah. were just a whole different right. old couple oh, living. Yeah. That's why it didn't work, nigga. You can't separate oh, the two. You can't raise me right. and then be like, oh, I'm a different person now. <laughs> right. Right. No. And all of a sudden, Felicia was like hella sleeping on all the episodes. They unbuilt her? Did they like she switch her up? hella sleepy. <laughs> that was white one. You know what show I didn't like? Oh my God! <laughs> I just got. All right. I'm, I'm, I'm late. Oh, yeah. Keep, keep up. I'm here. And what was, it was Saved by the Bell. What was the other one? City Sparks? City something? City Boys? City something? City, City, City Guys. City High. I didn't watch City Guys. Oh, what the fuck was City High? It was like, do y'all remember this? It was City yeah, High. I'm gonna do this. City High is a that's a movie. Singing. That's a movie. Yeah, that's I'm a singing about, group. No, it was something like that though. It was, it was City like, something. City guys. Reggie Theus was on there. It was City Guys. <laughs> <laughs> He's a teacher. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I did not you watch like that. that no, I'm saying that show didn't stick with me. Oh man, hell no, nah, it didn't stick with nobody. That would hit yeah. harder if everybody knew the show. <laughs> <laughs> in the house isn't very good when you watch it. You don't know, like in the house. In the house. Oh, have you watched it recently? Nah, nah. No, you um, shouldn't. Oh, what's name holds up? My wife and kids holds up. Oh, absolutely. Mark, yes. The Bernie Mac show goes crazy. Bernie Mac still. show holds up for sure. Um, Everybody I never, hates Chris. Really, I holds never got to that, bro. Oh man, should I? Should I? I could, I could go back right now and watch it. Yes, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Right. It's fucking really funny. Yeah. That shit is funny, yeah. man. That shit is laugh out loud funny. Yeah. It's funny. Is it like uh, uh, Larry David? Kicking ass, boy. Huh? I said, is it like Larry David in a way? Nah, it's, it's, in, uh, in like tone or pace. It's 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 a Wonder Years with a little more edge. It's like oh, three man. braids. <laughs> I would say it's like three braids. Damn. <laughs> Line back. your beard up before they you come. Right. Symmetry. Ah! That's Symmetry. why I know I got to be funny with this snap because I know I don't have hair right. <laughs> at all, bro. So what, do, what, do you, what do you be asking? for? What do you be asking for? No, we ain't got hair. It's so hilarious. What do you be asking for? It's funny. <laughs> that's, that's just, I know you be like, you get the same shit every yeah, time. Not, not, not every time. Yeah, you see, nigga feel, nigga feel well, like, so no, not like, I know sometimes you get it braided back and then. But the yeah, it just depends on how it is. So like, but I don't know what I would ask yeah. for. No, nah, like, so sometimes you'd be like, just do your thing. And oh, she'd be like, do your thing. Yeah. That's, yeah. That's, that's, that's 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 do your thing. You know, you're going to be McDonald's with all the drinks. Nigga, we got McDonald's with all the drinks. What are you going to like? It's Poway, Dr. Pepper, water, Fanta. Yeah. <laughs> like, see, there's a little milk in this bitch. <laughs> yeah, I do. Do your thing is hilarious. Do your thing. You pay for doing your thing? How much you pay for do your thing? It's the same. It's the same. It's the same. It's the same. Do you think it's the same as like a, a style? Like a, yeah. Is she gonna do it it is a style. Do you fall asleep? Do you do like in like her in between her leg while she's doing it, or you stay up the whole time? Like no, no, no. She is in the salon. But for yeah. for just to whatever, I don't know what the fuck how I should have intro that. But to Remo's <laughs> to Remo's credit, I guess most niggas who get braids. Uh-huh. Or ha- get their hairstyle. Will say 
just do whatever. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Like, 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 ain't coming because, in there like, let me get three to the back. But no, nah, because no, I don't want you jumping. The, the don't jump, get like, up, you I'm back up, I'm fellas. You have to no. like research. You got to Google <laughs> and find a picture and then take your right. picture and be like, I want, yeah. I want it to look like this. Yeah. And that's. That's a lot to do. Yeah, it's a lot. To do. I think women do that like with Pinterest a lot. You know what I'm saying? Women, women do that, and they, that's why if you got a stylist, it's really a stylist. If you want her to do something specific, she's gonna ask you to show her Pinterest. Now, if you're getting your hair done and say it's one braid in right right now, and she still hasn't done the two, and you see a lady, <laughs> you see a lady that wants to get her hair done. Is a gentleman like like you can go ahead to me, or do you make the lady wait till you get your hair done? So she I'm get getting her my hair done. Now she's her getting way. her hair. It's done. important. So so you and her getting your hair done. And, and you say, lady, this hair lady, envy is crazy. It's, um, you see, it's I real crazy. Like, I have a question. <laughs> this is I wild. I just have a question. I'm glad I got somebody like this. <laughs> <laughs> All these niggas got hair. Them niggas eyebrows are moving. This shit crazy, dog. This shit crazy, dog. Hey, these niggas should have been sitting next to each other like in the front. This is really envious. I just want to go ahead. I never had braids. You know what I mean? My God took my hair like 26. So I look at it like us dope. So I have a question. <laughs> God, <took my> <laughs> <hair>. <laughs> if it go, it go. Ah, it off to Most niggas don't lose their hair in their 40s. You should have left at 23? My shit was at 23. I was literally Jeez. just leaving college. Like, oh my God, this would have been crazy to be losing my hair in college. Oh, I had yeah. to fight every day. Yeah. Yeah. But yo, I wanted, my question was when she showed you in the mirror, you like, you did your thing. <laughs> do you just just do your thing. Oh, you oh, did your thing. Everyone You close man. your eyes and then she show you the mirror and you be like, oh nigga. <laughs> yeah, she turn you around the chair and you just be like, you did your thing. Yeah, that's funny as fuck. So uh, the the majority of the time I don't know what's going on. Yeah. And then, like, sometimes she might spin me around or whatever. Then I get a chance <laughs> yeah. to see it. Yeah. And then, like, that is funny. That's dope. And then you, like, when I, when I get bearded, like, my line Bearded. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even know what to call it. <laughs> we do not belong no more. Bearded, uh, chair no more. Bearded. Bearded. We're bearded. so far away from my like, chair. I mean, I like compliments. Do you, like, when you out, do you like one nigga? But, hey, nigga. Hey, that's, is that the suicide? <laughs> is that the suicide? <laughs> that's, that's, the, that's, the, that's to do your thing. And you be like, yeah, I appreciate it. Oh, that. you went to Keisha. To, you went, you got to do your thing from Keisha. Aye. That's hard. Hey, who, 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 who you? Who you? Who are you? That's how I be, though. That's how I be, Aye. like. That, your that's dope, man. That's it's a liberated community, bro. man. You just not getting into it. That's shit. dope. That's bro. funny as shit, dope, bro. bro. These niggas are hilarious. hilarious. I'm not think it's dope. Nah, I do. I would do everything with my shit too. Like y'all, yeah, y'all would be making so much fun of me if I had it. <laughs> what like, you can do it, bro? Like if it and like I you was able to grow it, like, yeah. nigga. Shh, I don't know what I'll do, but I wouldn't say this. <laughs> <laughs> This nigga Tyler would be in there. that bitch with pictures. Yeah, I'll be in that bitch with a whole portfolio. Let me like, get a bang in the yeah. front. Let me get the Iverson 08. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get the Denver Nugget. Let me get the Game 2. Right. Uh, <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> series got that shit down pat. That's nigga. funny as fuck. How you get it to stay like braided, like at night? You gotta wear like a thing over it? Bonnet. A bonnet? You wear a bonnet? I, I wear a bonnet sometimes. You gotta wear bonnets. Or a do rag. Oh, bet. I don't. Nigga, you got more hair than. Samson, my nigga. He, you wear a bonnet? Shit. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> These niggas' hair is. They gotta wipe their ass and wipe their hair. This is what I'm saying. <laughs> I mean, come on, bro. They ahead of the game. They ahead of the game. So, y'all wearing no do rag or nothing? I have. When you first get it. At least. Nah, I got a, I got a satin pillowcase. See, you know what I'm saying? Like, they ain't going to do it how he do it. His wife do hair, though, so that makes sense. Like, he, she know what to do. Ain't gonna Marcus lie. told me to do that because, you know, my beard fucked up. He was like, bro, if you get a satin pillowcase. I'm telling you, bro. For, for real. Because that, that, that cotton be drying the nigga out. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it, pull, it pulls at your hair. Mm-hmm. That's what I meant to say. Yeah. So, if you're at home and you don't have satin pillows, make sure you order some because it's good for your hair and it's good for your skin. And you could look like Remo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Right, do, your thing. You can also <laughs> do your thing. You can also do your thing. Like, share, subscribe. Well, that's a t-shirt right there. Do your thing. Do your thing. No, so how, how was it uh, um, working on that on the HBO show? Like, HBO stand-up. Oh, I know it's crazy. different. It's different than just like... like my lighter all the way down there. Uh, oh, I need to solve a problem real quick. You can use that lighter real quick again. Oh, uh, it's cool, man. <laughs> uh, because it's like being in New York is cool. It's cold as hell. But like the show is like, 
It's dope. Your boyfriend be calling the motherfucker this yeah, time. Yeah, But Monty cool because he already got a point of view. So it's like you, you don't have to write for the host. He kind of like is giving you the breakdown of how he feels about the point. And then you kind of highlight that in a f- kind of way palatable for TV. You know what I mean? Punch it. Find, and you get to find your own jokes, which is cool. Like, I got to find a clip I think is funny. They verify. It's cool. You get to produce it a little bit. So it's like it's a lot of fun. And then it's like, you know, he trusts me with the stand-up. Like, you know what I mean? Right. So, like, I get to, like, come to him directly. You know what I mean? And be like, yo, dude, he trusts me with that. So it's kind of cool. You know what I mean? Now, for people that, that, that aren't in the world of writing, tell them why that is cool and why it's different. Uh, when you write, it's like a hierarchy, and so when you go to the host, usually it's either the showrunner or the executive producer, okay. and the writers kind of lag back, you know what I mean? And they'll they'll come to you or whatever, but to be able to be like, bypass that and just go straight to him is like a testament, like you yeah, just trust, like, you know, any insight I may have, you know what I mm-hmm. mean? So that's the middle man. Yeah. And it's called Game Theory on HBO, y'all run it up, season two coming. Yeah, um, this yeah. yeah. yeah it did. Congratulations. But also on HBO right now. The headliners. The yeah. headliners. Come on, yeah. man. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. That shit was fun. Hey, dog. Listen, I did that thing the first show, and I did my joke about uh, the neighbors fighting. And Marlon was like, you got to kill that joke. You know what I mean? He's like, just because they didn't like the HBO. I was like, ah. So I was like, okay, cool. I did substitute something else. Mm. You know what I mean? I was like, damn. Was it like 15-minute substitution? No, nah, I was just like, you're supposed to do 10 minutes. I thought okay. it was like. I took my how much time he had to figure out the change. In between yeah. shows. Oh, between shit. shows. He was like, uh, just. Oh, well, first he was like, you coming off too mean. So, okay, cool. So I did the joke and I smiled more. Right, still did. <laughs> right, I smiled more. And, and then I let the Craig give me a tag in between shows. The lady ended up winning at the end of the joke. You know what I mean? So it didn't look like I was right. promoting whatever, but they ended up cutting that bit. But that shit was fun, dog. Yeah. The suit I ain't like, you know, because I don't like performing suits, but that's my best set I feel like on TV where I felt the most where I felt like I was in a comedy club and not just how I got a tape and you felt like the, the comfortableness of like I was making up shit on the spot a little bit to okay. for a transition you know what I mean just being comfortable in that for shit sure. that shit felt good it looked yeah. like it 100% came through yeah I mean she'll tap in with that yeah she's nice hell yeah man and nigga in velvet Right. Also wrote on uh, Kev, Kev on stage is Churchy. Oh yeah, yeah. That's for real? Yeah, yeah I wrote the first season that way. Come on man talk your shit bro. Oh yeah yeah, yeah. I wrote the first season of Churchy with Kev on stage. That shit was cool. Because Kev on stage, pay on time. Uh, easy to work with. He pay on time. He easy to work with. I think it pays on time. Uh, hey. Excuse me, I apologize. <laughs> because some people don't. But he does. You know what I mean? he pay, he pay. Some, he, some networks don't. Does but he, he does. Pay on time? When I tell you he pays on time, <laughs> you know what I mean? He pays on time. Number one. And he's easy to work with. You know what I mean? He's good, man. man. That's a good, whole good. Man. Yeah. Yeah, I fucking care, man. Yeah. Care, for real. He really he's always care. looking to reach Everything. out to help. Yeah. Always, yeah. man. He could really just be really on his own shit of keep his people in his circle. Yeah. But like every time you look at him, you work with somebody else. Yeah, That's sure, too, bro. Easy to work with too. Not yeah. arrogant, you know what I mean? Yeah. Some people, I feel like the most arrogant people, the people who ain't really on or got it, mm. right? Because ain't no reason to yeah. be yeah. that way. Yeah, when you got it. I remember doing Keep Your Distance the first time he paid me. He paid me the, before I did the show, and it was like. To me, for a stand-up spot in L.A., the most money I've made, right? I think we all tested that. They pay like 50, 75 bucks. Shit. And Ken paid for that. I called him. I said, hey, man, you meant to send me $50. Nah, I know you did not. I, dog, call him. I said, you meant to send me $50. He goes, no, Sid. I said, hey, Kevin, man, I know you got it. <laughs> but I don't want you to lose it. I, I don't like, want you to lose the you, way you're doing it. You ain't got to pay. Paying everybody this? You ain't got to pay. He said, no, 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 it's okay. I was like, all right. And then, I let, you know, he just solid. Good dude, man. Yeah. man. Make sure y'all get go get that book too. Oh yeah, book just, wife, book just dropped, man. Book just dropped. They ain't noble. They ain't Barnes and Noble. They ain't the noble. Cause this boy online on TV on your Barnes and Noble. Fuck you, man. Kept stays on your in your face. He might have to know right now. He might have some cereal. Absolutely. Absolutely. Like Wayne Brady. Yeah. You know what I'm saying going crazy. He got his own network. Come on, on stage app. Man, support, man. Support Gotta everybody, support, bro. Man. You know what I'm saying? We only on for an hour. We appreciate that. Support, the, support this podcast. Run it, man. Support it, share it, man. Tell the like, friend. Like, subscribe, comment, yeah, you share. Got your merch. You know what I'm saying? Well. Hey, yeah, so it's your, your merch, though. Yeah, 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 man. I let me. My cup is full. It's my fun to talk about anxiety. It's full. I can't take a bunch of information, so I say my cup is full. Boom. Go ahead and get it. Just got them. Fresh. The hat's still hot on my head. Am I doing good? I'm not going to promo. No, it's great. It's great. The sticker's still on it. Sticker still on it. Yeah. You can buy this one. You can buy this one. Right. Follicles and all. Oh, he cut your line. That's crazy.
back at you. you back. G, I ain't going to let you do That was nice. That's like a punch you take. you like, okay, nigga. All right. <laughs> I got it. I got a joke coming. Got me, Jake. Yeah, damn it. Bad punches are hilarious. So, so what? What's the difference in so being a seasoned comedian? We always ask people the difference between stages in LA and X Y Z. Now you've been stages in LA and New York prominently. What is the difference to you? I feel like in Newark. Excuse me, in New York, you got to keep writing because that they not. It's like a different type of laugh. They laugh and then they, you, need, you need to keep going because it's not like they're going to just, it's like a different rhythm, I guess you can explain. Get a roll. Yeah, so you got to keep writing. Like, you know what I mean? You got to keep writing. Like, I remember being out there doing jokes. I thought, I was, oh, the joke was over and they still like one more or something. Like, okay, you got to like keep writing. To me, it forced me to tell my stories because when the story, I can tell a bunch of jokes in the story, my point of view or whatever. But just like the simple jokes or whatever, to me, that don't really work out there. It's like, you know, the point of view is strong. Anybody out there, they got all points of view. So it make you be like, all right, but I know I'm different because of who I am. But it make you just work on your point of view. Like, I can't wait to get back out there with the shit I got I've been working on. Right. I can't wait to take it to New York. Mm. And you can fine tune it because you go up so many times. They got shows at 1.30 in the morning. That's what I heard, bro. You can do, like, four shows a night. Yeah. We had to work at, like, get up at 8. I had a show at 1.30. It's running late because Dave might be there. And then you, I get home, like, 2.30. Yeah. Yeah, and then, yeah, Dave Chappelle might be there or Chris Rock when they was working on that shit. Right. They just show up, so they bump everybody. So, you know what I mean? But you go up and you want to watch them. You get home late. You got to get up work in the morning. You know, so that's the grind, okay? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I run on the HBO show, but I also be out there in the stand-up streets till 1.30 in the morning. Talk your shit till 1.30. You know what I mean? Wish I could get my hair braided. I can't. Can't. I can't do it. You get bearded, though. Yeah, I can get bearded. <laughs> you did. <laughs> I wish I could be in this bitch looking like Anita Baker's son, but I cannot do it. <laughs> Anita Baker's son? I just, that was for earlier. That was like, I was setting that up. I was Damn, saying, what's, what's Anita's son's name? A Remo. <laughs> <laughs> Remo Baker. <laughs> oh, fucking like, subscribe, That's comment. So yeah. <laughs> I've been going at it all week, man. Sure. So, so Remo, man. I love how, Remo, man. How's your first season wilding out, man? You be ready because we're in. Yeah, oh. man. That shit feel good. I ain't going to lie, bro. Um, y'all niggas are fast with the shit. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like now I kind of got the rhythm of it. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's cool to kind of study the games. But when you in the flow of things and all of this shit coming at you, you got two or three castmates that need something. Then you got to run over and make sure the guest has their vibe and their rhythm. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's cool, though, man. It's, it's network TV. It's done at the highest level. Um, when we were doing a snack pack, it was always a dream to see it done at this level and to see, like, 100 people come for one idea for 20 minutes is amazing. You know what I mean? It's a testament to teamwork, bro. So that shit, it feels good to be a part of it, man. Feels As I gave you all the time, if I could compliment you. Please do. Go ahead. You know what I mean? It's going to look like I'm being sarcastic, but I'm being for real. Some people get the job, like he was saying earlier, and get the job and they like fuck off. You know what I mean? It's like me and Tyler make a living doing this. I know it seems fun on the ground, but when we're doing it, it's nah, work. work. I'm a compliment you can't say anything. So uh, it's, it's, it's kind of cool. You gonna, I have anxiety. You're going to fuck up my train of thought. Uh, it's cool to see, like, take the job seriously. Like, I'll be fucking with him, like, hey, you can't do what I do because I'm going to sneak off and do whatever, smoke, come back, whatever, but just be visible. But like now I was saying, like you always visible, you always seen, like you be working, you be like, you be talking to the guests confidently and you do your thing. You know what I mean? So like that's dope. You know what I mean? I feel like when they bring the season back to look for other writers, I think it ain't no question of like, oh, we should be Remo back. I don't know, like just cause he cool, it's like cause you be working hard. You feel me? Yeah, so as I tell true. these jokes, just know like they're gonna man. keep coming, but you be doing your thing. You got a great rapport yeah. with a lot of the Cast yeah, too. You know not all of them, but some of them. Some of them. <laughs> some of them. Especially the newer ones, though. That <laughs> so, question, Remo. How yo shit, sir? So, I mean, you have tons of experience on sets, just, you know, and throughout, you know, different roles, playing different roles. How do you think that has contributed to, you know, your success and, and the way that... That to is totally the reason why I'm about. not fucking off. You know what I'm saying? Because it's a certain thing called set etiquette. And if you don't have it, niggas kind of just, you just smell. You just be like, nigga, why are you here? What's set etiquette for people who don't know? So set etiquette is um, when things are serious, get serious with the moment. Even though you might be ripping or 
doing something that's super cool to you at the time, like be focused on the job at hand. Cause sometimes this shit is like in between breaks, for an example, is what two minutes, three minutes mm-hmm. as they set up the stage and the guests might just go blank. They don't remember shit. Y'all went over for like 30 minutes. They don't remember shit. So now you got to kind of coach them and be like, you know, a director and, it's, it's a lot of those things, man, a lot of those attributes and opening up to the camera, just making sure, you know, you tell the guests what to do. All that shit, man, it, it, it definitely contributes, man. I ain't going to lie. Shit like working fast food, you might be chilling for a while and it's a rush. Dog. You got to be ready for that rush. You got to get all the food together. You got to make sure it's right, make sure it's about as clean. And then that shit go away all of a sudden. Because like, oh, shit, some old niggas. Come right. Up. We just got a bus. <laughs> 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 just we got, got a group home. Yeah, yo, and then the next game was classroom. You're like, oh, I get a break. <laughs> I get a break. Oh, yeah. It's a hurry up and wait industry, man. But goddamn it, when you hurry, you must hurry. But no, nah, it's cool, man. I ain't gonna lie. Um, Try to find a way to bring all y'all niggas in, man. Man, because everybody can work. I can see everybody in every position that they love, man. And Nick, man, like to have the ability to be trusted by a network to do your own shit. And I don't even know if they're looking over that boy's shoulder like that. But he's putting on all types of fucking people from all types of backgrounds. Like, the nigga clank, clank, my dog. Yeah. Mm. Praise That's the crazy. Lord for his story, yeah, man. Like clank, clank, the nigga almost jumped off. The- <laughs> <laughs> this nigga was mad today, bro. Like, clank, it's going to be all right. You still here, dog. Mm-hmm. Clank, clank. That's in your ass, huh? Clank, clank. Cool dude from, like, Florida. Super cool dude. Yeah, the first time on TV. Sure. Excited to be there. Like, you know what I mean? Work hard. Yeah, that's yeah, what I'm saying. Man. But uh but yeah, man, so, nigga, how is your Wednesday going? You stepping into the hosting goddamn pretty hard. Hey, come Apache, on, listen, I just want to say this before we jump. You know what I mean? I think Tyler can attest to this. As soon as he fuck up, you on. You feel me? <laughs> <laughs> so don't 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 be like, damn, I hope a door opens. That's the door. <laughs> <laughs> the door right across from me. You already sent your picture, man. <laughs> He's like, oh, no, no, we know him. You can get it. Man, let me tell you. This podcast. When, oh, when Tyler looks at you and be like this. Get your bitch right. Start, start stretching. Start stretching, nigga. Get your bitch right. That's so motherfucking. Go ahead. That's hilarious. But nah, man, it's, it's, it's cool. You know, it's, it's starting something from the ground up. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? And mm-hmm. build, building it all the way up from, from nothing. So. You know, I know what that takes from, you know, my experience on the production side of things. So, um, but, you know, it's been fun hosting, you know, getting the opportunity to do as much as much time as I want to um, and having complete control of the shit. So, Fucking with Rod Rose, you're going to get your reps. It's been fun. It man. did. Shout out Rod Rose. Shout out Rod man, man. Rose. It's made me fun, laugh man. media. Hosting, bro. Man, I'm getting my mother. Yeah, and I'm I'm funny, bro. No, this is more confirmation of that real for shit. myself. Real shit. Can we can we highlight Kamal real quick? Let's do it. Um, Kamal is a comedian, and you know what I mean. And Tyler raves about him to me. I was like, yeah, for real, can I check it out? That nigga funny. You He's know funny, what I mean. Funny. So shout out to Kamal because most niggas when they first start, they're like, oh, okay, you're doing it. Kamal funny. So if you yeah. in the area and Kamal going up, you need to go to a show. Pull up on. That was dope. I'm gonna cut nice. that and <laughs> use it. <laughs> yeah, and post Provo, it. Yeah, not for real. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, because I mean, we talk about it, but it, I don't think it can be said enough how good you were from the first day. The shit was, you did. It comedy. was scary. It was like, yeah. God damn. Remo quit a little bit again. I, I did. I don't that. even know if you remember that shit. <laughs> I was like, well, I mean, guys, you know. <laughs> So we're gonna go to the, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna just like really focus on the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I said, Ooh, come on, it's up there with me. I think it's time no. to start back acting. <laughs> got a new headshot. Got audition. Got a new headshot. I'm about to get an agent. <laughs> like, was, was in the chair and the producer like, I just feel like <laughs> I just feel God like, is telling me to focus on me right now. <laughs> so just be, do your thing. Just do your thing. <laughs> just do your thing. <laughs> Just, just, do just do your thing. thing. Just do your thing. Oh, that's hilarious. That's funny. Nah, yeah, very, very funny, man. I got to say, cool. nah, appreciate, appreciate y'all tapping in with us nah, every time, sure. even at live at the spot. Nah, facts. Um, Except Steve, man. Fuck you, Steve. <laughs> Steve, man. You got that's two episodes. That's got to be your, your name. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell you uh, off camera somebody else who I thought I think it might. Be. Oh, word. <laughs> oh shit, you might, you might. Uh, you got a real live. Uh, uh, what? 
that troll, I guess. He got oh, a real man, life troll. They go live from when he do the spot, right? On oh, Thursday. Thursday nights. It's a live from, from our YouTube. It's a live stream. And anytime I go in there, it's a nigga. I'm talking about as soon as he, as soon as he say one fourth or more than culture, they go, I hope it ain't come on. <laughs> <laughs> That's a little bit, Come on, man. This, I can't stand this nigga. This man. nigga throws digital tomatoes. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. That nigga types, ugh. Tomato emoji. But Tomato the nigga, emoji. But the crazy is the nigga knows all my shit, I dog. know. He knows your fan. all my shit. He's like, oh, here comes this joke. Comes this yeah, this nigga studies you, bro. He's autistic. He knows everybody's shit. Bro. That's a recycle of joke. Like, who the fuck is this nigga, man? That's funny. Shout out to y'all, man. Y'all pull up every week, man. Yeah, dude, that's hilarious. Yeah, shout out to y'all, man. Schmelgo will be on the 30th Ooh, of yeah. September. That shit growing, bro. Best in Bruin. Yeah, I had yeah. a great one last time. Yoga. Last I mean, so. Uh, that nigga Dex was doing some yoga. Yeah, Nate, Nate. I do it that was, in real life, though. Yeah, you, do, you do yoga in real life? Yeah, nigga. Yeah. Can't tell. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, I can't tell. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, nigga. Don't you can tell stretch, nigga. You can't smell me, nigga. Nigga, I can bend over right and touch all this. I had to clean that because I was like bending over. I was like, "Kid is over." That's all this. <laughs> ah, shit. That's hilarious. Hey, shout out to Tyler, man. Tyler yeah. be writing on yeah. the show. Tyler be performing on the show. Tyler be getting recognized by the guests on the show. Come on, Tyler man. be walking in the room and like the celebrities like, "Oh, Tyler." You know what I mean? Look, shit cool as hell, dog. That's when when so Cat cool. Williams, oh, can I say that? Do you think? I'm sorry. When Cat Williams poked his head, I was like, "Chronicles." Oh, also, though, we in, when we went inside the trailer, he didn't come in. Yeah, man, because too much of y'all. Oh, <laughs> we were talking shit. I ain't getting my picture. He had to drop somebody off. With Kat, we were talking shit, and he was, they said, and said something. He was like, because, you know, you guys are comedians, and that's, they didn't have, like, real comedians and writers back when mm. he was on the show. And he said, like, I didn't even know who, you knew who I was. He said, that, that's because you are tall. And I, <laughs> he said, I cannot look up there. Anything, <laughs> anything above five, seven hurts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He said City likes to keep all the good jokes for himself. <laughs> oh, I said, I ain't know you know I would. Yeah, I know you are. I don't want to sit down with grown man. I can't sit and look at you the whole time. Doing <laughs> that. But that's what I've heard about him. Like he, dope, he knows man. every comic, that's man. Crazy. He's doing some work and he fucking knows you. So that was mm-hmm. dope. Nigga shit. <laughs> Waterboy just, just ran me down when I was coming to pick you up. He like, he's hitting him and I'm like, I'm good. He's like, nah, 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 you got to, you got to, you got to. <laughs> I'm going to roll one He's like, I know you from Wilder now. Uh-huh. You got to fuck with me. Hey, hey, yeah. You got to. <laughs> you got to. <laughs> Boy, give me a bottle. Hey, hey, hey. And he said, and we got the cash yet, big bro. Come on. Bro. And we got the cash yet. <laughs> <out. laughs> right over there on 10th Street. Yeah, man. what's up, bro? Oh, shout out to that little nigga. Yeah. Let me shout him out for real, man, because I definitely seen him. Yeah, yeah, you know, draw that, draw that nigga a dollar, man. Change your life real quick. Yeah. Yeah, y'all show him some love, man. Yeah, out there. It's, late, it's late at night. It was like fucking nine o'clock and shit. Hashtag Molten Culture when you send it. You yeah, it did. Come on, man. You doing? Hey, man. You on your game? Hey, dog. Tim, man. Shout out to the young Tim Johnson, man. Tim, Tim. J. Got dog on Tim J. <laughs> <laughs> Got dog on Tim oh, J. J. <laughs> That'll do it. Anything else? <laughs> cool, dog. Is it that time, my bro? Man, we leaving already? No, nah, man, you know it's cool. Yeah, man, what you got to talk about, man? You got to get some man. shit off your chest. Like last it. time you was here, man, you was, you know, I heard, uh, you know, you said a lot of people watched the episode and been talking to you about it, right? Yeah, 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 but some people been talking to you about it, about your uh, your, your relationship talk. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. You broke up a family, nigga. Talk about that. <laughs> oh, what happened, man? I didn't break them up on purpose. No, but you oh, did boy, do it. Is, oh, boy, was trying to be funny. I was just asking people in the audience, hey, you with them? Like, yeah, you in love? Somebody like, yeah, I love her. Like, all right, cool. And I asked somebody else, like, yeah, I love her. I asked this dude, I said, hey, you in love? You, this your girl? Like, yeah, you love her? He was like, depends on the day. Uh, right. right, he was trying to be okay, funny. Yeah. And the whole Why crowd was like, oh. So then I was like, and her face. That was embarrassing. Her face looked like, mm. So then I was like, all right, I'm going to take up for my little mom real quick. And I like roasted him real quick. Boom, come back. It was like, give him another chance. So, hey, man. And you could say I don't love her, but she cool. We just dating right now. Right. And then he says something else like slick. Yeah. Right. Then boom, ro- roast him again. Come back. He gone. <laughs> boom, roast. He gone. He gone. He not, not there. Out. And they was like, I said he gone. 
So yeah, and I was like, roast him again. And then, and then <laughs> what? I told her basically like, hey man, don't worry about it. you good. You know, and then like, you know, just some impression like, you know, black some black woman's gonna pull you outside, like, baby, come here, you don't need him. <laughs> oh my but God. But now I've been walking around, people like, hey, what's up? Nigga, HBO Max, like he said, all this shit, people like, hey man, you funny as hell, thank you. You broke up that couple. <laughs> 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 like, oh, Damn, it wasn't together bro. for real, man. Nigga got yeah. too fast. She, I know a nigga, Sheesh. and I know a nigga slid on her after. Dog, the show. all the comments to. be like, "Hey, yo, did you get her number? What's her Instagram?" What's her Instagram? <laughs> That's hilarious. Yeah. yeah, she was a straight little cool little white girl. Man. Yeah, yeah, okay. but Chocolate Sundays, man, been going up for you for videos. Dog, shit, right? dude, that shit been yeah, wow. dog, that shit. Like I said, I be getting recognized from the Laugh Factory clips. That shit be going up. I be making money off that shit. Yeah, because they'll the Laugh Factory cool. They'll pay you like what you make online oh, from the YouTube. clips. So random, oh, that's just real. going in the account. That's all right, bitch. How does it feel now uh, seeing your jokes on like TikTok and Instagram and people like redoing them, but not you know what I mean tagging you and no shit like that? Uh, I mean it's like damn, like I want the followers, you know what I mean. But then it's like you can't control that shit. It'd be dope though. I used to wait tables, nigga. So like now it's like when that shit happened, it'd be like just you know you been doing stand up a long time, so it'd be like it's just cool. That shit cool. That shit do be cool. You'd be like damn, but, yeah, that should be cool. Y'all tag me, Ronnie and Darren on our video, man. Shit, the videos be going crazy, crazy, bro. Yeah, that shit, they, they got, they had a, seen this shit a chat thread, I mean, a Twitter yeah. thread, literally saying what we were saying in the video. Damn. But some, yeah, somebody was like, the PM for song to get out of here. That TV I was like, yo, and Shade Room posted like those. I was like, all right, now this is gone too far. I usually don't give a fuck. Now, yeah. uh, yeah. Niggas are still making it like it's your tweet. Yeah. That is stupid. Like, it's not one of those things where it's just to, like we literally cut, cut the camera on and we just be talking shit like how we do and then we take the best parts of it. But still, nigga. Yeah, let a nigga know. Yeah, I thought of that like in a couple seconds, but it's still my shit. So. And we can use the followers, to be honest with you, dog. The followers. Like, give us the followers, dog. You know what I mean? Yeah. Shout us out so we can get the followers, get our numbers up. Because they need to watch the show like y'all be watching. Yeah. Don't share this shit, cuz. Don't hog it up, though. Dog. Don't hog that shit. Bitch. Don't hog it, cuz. But I was, I wasn't talking about breaking people up, though. Like, somebody was mad about what the shit you was talking about. Yeah, somebody was mad about the shit you was talking, man. It was mad, dog. But <laughs> some people, dog, if you go on YouTube, mm-hmm. it's funny. It's like a YouTube audience and a Facebook audience. Mm-hmm. A YouTube audience be laughing. A Facebook audience be Seriously. breaking down your set. Oh, okay. Facebook audience be like, that's crazy that he, that, that he could just talk about somebody that why does, he doesn't have to be in love. And then people was like going, like, uh, yeah, he's going to get beat up one day. Just keep going to the audience. What? <laughs> and you got to be trained and growing up to be like, not hit reply. Right. right. <laughs> and so you just keep rolling. But Facebook, they be like breaking it down. He's just a comedian. He's just having a good time. It's not, and I'm like, damn, but YouTube be like, LOLs, LOLs. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? They be breaking, they have discussions over there. Different. Yeah, yeah all these social media got every, every, yeah, every, every, every I like platform. All talk talk about me, talk about my name. Get it out there. Let's get how yeah, My favorite bitch. niggas is on Twitter, though. Twitter. My favorite niggas is on Twitter, bro. I, 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 did I say this on here before? I don't know. I found African Twitter, and it's so hilarious. Af- what African is African Twitter? Twitter? I follow one African on Twitter one time, <laughs> and he was funny. And you know, they, you know, retweets just go crazy. So then he follow like two or three African motherfuckers that do jokes. Man, oh man, these niggas is funny. They got wild ass porn. First of all, <laughs> 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 you know that part. That nigga jump from <laughs> jokes to I know that. Part. That's all I got on my Twitter. Yeah, it's just funny. Like porn and funny. funny titties. Yeah, <laughs> jokes. But yeah, African Twitter. D I R M A X. Follow that and it'll take you to the rest of what you need to see. Funny is <laughs> That was funny. African is funny. See, I don't get some of the jokes too, so that'd be funny too. They, be like, they put a whole bunch of laughing emojis and I lost the whole shit. Like, oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> I don't feel African enough, bro. I was <laughs> getting jokes, my nigga. Yeah, man. But yeah, shout out to Africa, my nigga. Why is that funny? <laughs> God damn, that nigga want his beard back. So, <laughs> shout out to Africa. <laughs> but that was sincere, though. Like, this is probably, mm-hmm. I think, do people watch this from all right. No, they do, bro. Shout out to Africa, man. Shout out to all y'all continents and countries, bro. Big you know cities and states. Watching. Niggas be in Australia be hitting us up. UK, obviously, man. Okay. Shout out to y'all. Um, what was the nigga in New Zealand? It was like he was fucking with the pot, especially during COVID and shit, like the first quarantine. That's when a lot of people from overseas was hitting yeah. us up. Like, I, I love the Hey, shout out to the niggas that be on set that fuck with the podcast. Bruh, yeah, shout out man. to the, uh, the dudes who, the producers on the set. 
It's a uh, father and son duo. Yeah, man. Trey. You know what I'm saying? Trey. They like, make the music for all the while and out beats. Everything you hear on TV, you know what I'm they make Oh, that's all yeah, that with the You're like, nigga, I'm trying to put my daddy on, but that nigga be sleepy. <laughs> <laughs> that boy be getting Yo, sleepy. Yo, shout man. out, out to this, shout out to this nigga named Brian from Brian Services. Oh shit, he fuck with the podcast. That nigga has done some work in my crib, man. And it's good dude, and looked out. Told him I shot him out. Make sure you take a picture of that <laughs> yeah. nigga too. Shut up, that nigga be hell of a right. oh, fuck You got that work done four months ago. <laughs> nah, here's the thing. I got I, I had some work done and then I just had some more work you done. Shot me out. Out. That nigga he reminded me. Yes, sir. As he was leaving. Let's go. The nigga in his truck rolled his window. I was like, hey bro. <clears throat> Don't forget you said you go give me a shot out. <laughs> Y'all go look like, it up. Yeah. Brian Services out there in Georgia, services, man. services. And take a picture yeah, of that yeah, nigga, too, man. Anything done at your house, man. Shit. Plumbing, any kind of handiwork, man. Oh, a nigga dope, dog. He did my crib out here, dog. That nigga. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, I see when you, I tell you, that nigga so man. quick with the response, customer services through the roof. Yeah. I use them again and again. Man, shout out Car Wash Marcus, black um, car wash owner. He yeah. brings a bike. Yeah, generator. He got a whole trailer on a bike. I was like, oh, you a beast. I don't know where you came from. <laughs> the streets. <laughs> the nigga, the you know. carrying a generator on a bicycle? Bro, you know where I live. Like, it ain't a, like a bike-friendly area. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's heavy yeah. traffic. Well, it's hilly. bike-friendly with a generator on the back right. of the bike. That's... He ain't just got a generator. He got a generator, one of them blowers. He got all his rags. So, well, he got everything needed to wash a car. Everything. Wash Power the wash. Out of my car. Wash and vacuum your car. Is he wow. an MMA Classic. fighter? Like, what's he training he's for? A, he's a wow. six four slim nigga. I don't know. That nigga got he's calves of steel. That yeah, nigga kick your dough down. <laughs> what you mean? His license, <laughs> his license is one, big suspended. One kick. That's hilarious. Because he said, "Yeah, I can get over there." I, that's why I ain't know. <laughs> I talked to him on the phone. I gave my where's 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 where? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Over there. I was like, that sounded weird. But yeah, I ain't yeah, that that <laughs> 75, 85? Yeah, you know, okay, I get over there. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> on the highway, got there. <laughs> Football was on and everything. I listen to y'all podcasts the whole time. <laughs> Full episode. Shout out to him, man. Shout out to all black. And all the third shift workers, man. Got down, get through the day, get oh, yeah. through the night. Truck drivers. Yeah, truck drivers. What's up? All our listeners. You know what I'm saying? They, ain't, they don't know what it look like. Everybody in the car because they're arguing with their girl right now. They just getting away. What's Turn up? Turn that shit up. I speak for you. What's up, man? I get it. I've been there. I get that shit. She's just in the real. car just like Let me tell you something. on Twitch. Arguing in a car is the most oh, it's dangerous. deadliest thing that can it's happen. dangerous. Is it a punch or a drive? All that shit, bro. No, that shit just dangerous. Don't raise your voice in the car, bro. That's just, 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 bro. goddamn, pull over, nigga. So I was trying to fuck. I hit my head on the window. <laughs> 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 shit. That's just, ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh, oh. Yeah, like, ooh, been, ooh. Shit, I'm been talking about hitting a woman, but that was In a few <laughs> car arguments. That's what the time That shit, boop, boop. Oh, <laughs> loud and dangerous. You just got to keep driving that motherfucker. They're like, you really want to die. Like, you really Bruh. don't give a fuck. Bro. You speed up. The more, the more intense <laughs> oh the argument get, the foot. faster the car goes, like, The fact you can punch me while I'm driving, <laughs> let me know, man. You oh. are crazy as hell, man. Oh. What the fuck? Who, why why oh. would you kill yourself? I don't argue when they drive me. We can go to land when we park. <laughs> Nigga, I was driving. Oh, no. Yeah. She got to get out. Yeah, that's She got to get out. <laughs> My nigga, I was on the highway in full argument. Shawty pulled the steering wheel. Oh, oh man. No. She just I jerked that all bitch. Us. I killed all Fuck you. <laughs> like, bitch, you too. <laughs> nigga, no way. Yeah, it's dangerous, wow, bro. That's crazy. God damn. Ah, you that's said her crazy. name. Yeah, that's Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> oh, did he? I ain't here. No, yeah. I did. Oh, man. What? No, I did. Okay. He's going to have niggas rewind me. Like, yeah, oh, man. Yeah. 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 Listen to what he said. Uh, he they gonna slow it down. You know his name. Oh, you're you're right, 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 right. Right. Please yeah. get it out. Didn't <laughs> <laughs> say shit. Okay, bro. Because there was no, no need for you to say that word that you said. Yeah, I didn't say nothing, dog. It's a word. It's hey, man, word. God damn, run over it. Like, <laughs> don't, cut the, don't cut this part. <laughs> we were fucking crazy, man. Don't cut this part. It's the best part. <laughs> it's the, yeah, and that's when Tyler was like, maybe I could be a bad bitch. They hit me. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, I don't know. Nigga no. started to get facials. This nigga's face is peeling. Nobody ain't saying that. <laughs> God damn, man. Y'all I got friends. my moles removed, man. I don't get no face. He got his moles removed. <laughs> 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 I 
Why is that? What, what the you fuck are you? This nigga's prepared for Hollywood. First time I tell you that. Nigga, that's so funny. <laughs> you said I, you I, I never <laughs> met, never I was met him. Get wild, nigga. I was looking wild. <laughs> Morgan Freeman Jr. <laughs> 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 He's like, I couldn't tell, nigga. I could. Every time I looked in the mirror, I was like, oh, no. It's like somebody spit coffee in my fucking face. That's fine. It's a hereditary thing. My like, whole family got face molds. I was like, nope, not me. Ooh, I seen how the nigga look. You know what I'm saying? Still handsome, but it's a little duck puppy. <laughs> hey, let me tell you something, Skip. <laughs> Won't catch me slipping, no, no. <laughs> not the bump around my mouth. I'm to the death of me, Skip. <laughs> how are you, 33? <laughs> 10 years from now, how do you? 33. <laughs> Thank you, Tom Skip. I'm going to have one a diaper. Big old face, big old face. How old are you? 33. <laughs> yeah! That's hilarious. Yeah, man. Now, nah, I'm trying to preserve myself. I'm going to get a facial though. I, 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 I advise every nigga to take care of their skin, no, bro. Facts. You got to take care of If you get braids like that, you know a nigga take care of it. Yeah, yeah, man. You gonna, gonna look young, you still your hair black still, that shit. Yeah, yeah bro. Done, Good though. job, man. Good Niggas job. don't even know he's 62. <laughs> he's got no idea. Uh, uh, 62. Uh, it ain't fun. He takes such good care of his Yeah, shit. yeah man. It's a lot of water. Good. Drink a lot of water. Water, man. Water, water, water. Him and Jesse, <laughs> him and Jesse will be on set, just like yeah. exchanging exchange 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 shit. That's crazy. Hey, I, I need to ask one girl what they use for real. Yeah. Women got the best shit, like to keep up. Hey, you know what I started doing? Why am I talking so much? You good? Hey, this right. you know what I started doing? The um, San Antonio. Go ahead. From, <laughs> from, <laughs> from watching uh, the HBO shit with the uh, Winning Time on HBO, mm. see how Jerry Buss put his face in ice. Mm. That shit help. It like really take your bags down and like shrink your face in. I do that when I'm having a panic attack. Ice? Yeah, you put ice and you hold your breath because it make your uh, make your brain think you fighting for air. And you can help breathe. Okay. You got serious? Damn. How y'all doing? Nah, but somebody need to hear that. Nah, somebody, somebody need to hear that though. Not couple. <laughs> somebody need to hear that. that was yeah, somebody good. told me that. This white boy told me that. And I did it. I was like, oh, this is outside the comedy store. Like, yeah. They calmed me down. And then some comedy's like, where you, you got all like, the yeah. ice from? It's right by the uh, the pink dot, right there on Sunset. It's right by the parking lot, by the comedy store. They just uh, got a pool of ice. I was, I was like, can I get uh, some ice? He's like, yeah, you know, they're shaking. How much? Eight dollars. Uh, here you go. <laughs> 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 he could charge me ninety five dollars. Right. Yeah, yeah. It's two 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 eight nine dollars. <laughs> Run it <laughs> for the faint bitch. <laughs> that nigga. Man. That's the IB, bro. My body just get wet. And my Dog. Boy, I have one of them little panic attacks, man. It should be. You sweating? It be out of nowhere. Yeah. A nigga said, uh, nigga told me I'm finna go to one music fest. My body started sweating. Like, you know, so, uh, like, cause just thinking about being around that many people. He's like, okay. I love it. And I was like, ah. <laughs> Let me take a shot. That's funny. Exactly. Yeah. You talking about one music? Fan. <laughs> about to fight. You mean anxiety? <laughs> not fun at all, young man. <laughs> no one wants to live a life like this. I just got scared a little bit when he said this is one anxiety. I thought he was about to fight. I thought he was about to go down in this motherfucker. <laughs> nigga been through too much. But that's that nigga trigger word. <laughs> I've been through too much. Shit. So as he's sitting down at his therapist, she's saying, anxiety. Like, oh. 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 Appreciate y'all, man. Thank y'all for having appreciate me, dog. Hey, man. Yeah, Sid, appreciate Sid. you, man. Sincerely, thank y'all. Make sure you follow Sid. That said, he's funny. That's why D-N-E-Y is funny. He is sure funny. Because he funny. is funny, bro. Yeah. Uh, it's a good handle it. for you. Appreciate that, dog. All right, man. Time to show. Coach Comments. Coach Comments. <coughs> Got two of them. Ooh, let's go. First one from Oak Party. Oak Party. Tyler got on that do rag, and the U is for unnecessary. <laughs> 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 uh, no, it's not from this. It's from previous episodes. Oh, it's comedy. Yeah, Shout out, Jason. They put a capital U in do rag. Yeah, yeah. Lord Hammers. All right, next one. Shit. Next one. Random Ryan. There you Ryan go again. Random. Yeah, yeah. One more time in there. Let's go. Every time I hear about a shooting victim at Crystal's, I pray for Ronnie. <laughs> 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 oh, that's <funny. laughs> Crystal, bro. That's so random. That's bro. so Ronnie random, like, bro. <laughs> How many <laughs> niggas is getting shot at Crystal's? <laughs> Every time oh I hear God, about bro. a shooting at Crystal's. Oh, my God. That nigga got a Reddit account. <laughs> <laughs> 
Damn, bro. <laughs> Shout out to y'all again, man. Y'all are the best. Shit. We got the best fans in the world, or Culture Ricans. Mm -hmm. You want to shout out your brother? Mm. <laughs> DYT. Yeah, come on, man. Give him. Come on. DYT. <laughs> like businesses, dog. Miss DYT. Hey, man. Shout out to Akila, man. Uh, Akila George. I think that's her name on Instagram. Follow her. Tap in with her. You know Akeelah, what I mean? Akila, you like a sound? Get you DYT. Yeah, like the beat. You like the beat. Okay, boom. Bye bye. See, Akila, I'm looking out. This nigga was just going to log out. I'm going to get you your shine. You know Niggas going to walk up to your chair like, Can I, you did remodels? How you know that? He shines you out more Damn. culture. Yeah, she going to throw you a free bearding just because I'm <laughs> bearding. <laughs> nigga, like, hey, you do your thing, not like my <laughs> I need you to listen to me, goddammit. I need. Mean, <laughs> do your thing, but not like that thing. <laughs> it was that time, brother. Uh, um, yeah, man. It's that time. <laughs> it, it, it. <laughs> I don't know what I want to say, man. Come oh, on, man. You got some. We like to end the show with a segment we call Secret Genius <laughs> Life Coach. We're going to give people some words of wisdom, get through the week, get to the next episode. I am Kamal the Secret Genius, and the words of the week are this. It's been a lot. What's in your way, nigga? Cody? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't do that? <laughs> yeah, I'm the only one? Lord have mercy. I had already said this shit. The words of the week are this. Sydney, shut the fuck up. <laughs> those ain't the words. Those are just words for Sydney. It's been a lot of rappers dying a lot of celebrity death in general so remember this you don't know them people for real mm. so stop being in a rush it's supposed to dead body because some people do know them people for real and they don't want to see that shit and that's all they got yeah I was, you got to hey, turn that around I mean I get it that was serious. And Some of them be and, serious. And, I, and, and that that was necessary. Mm -hmm. Some of them be necessary. I don't need to go on Twitter and see nobody on the, you know what I mean? I love what you're doing, come on. I appreciate it. I feel it. like uh -huh. you, you know, you're going to speak to a large group of people, like a community one day, and you're going to influence the children. I got kids oh. that I influence. Yeah, I can feel it. I can feel it. As soon as we motherfucker fuck up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> When I tell you, you're going to be wild in, wild in. <laughs> All right, I'm done. Let's go. Hey, man, another one more thing. Because this is the other thing I was going to say. I'm going to say anyway. Just, your cup is full, bro. Your cup is full. Oh, yeah. White people, I'm going <laughs> to give y'all a gift. No. Huh? <laughs> y'all can, ha can have pause. Or y'all can use it. But when y'all use it, when somebody say some racist shit, Y'all can say pause. Get your shit together. Come on. Nah. Well, yeah. Cut that. Like, out. subscribe, comment. Yeah. Cut that part <laughs> out. Cut the racism. The last part out. I, it's, I, it felt okay to me. It feels great. It feels. It's like niggas with hair act like they don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's just one of those things that changed over, bro. It's something that you can't say no more. I feel. All right. You probably right. It used to be a thing. Y'all niggas you know more than me. <laughs> About that, you know what I'm saying? Hey, bro, you want to write on Wild and Out? Yeah! Damn, bro! Yo! I'm gone, man. Yo, I ain't mean right. it. How, right. I, how I do the apology? How I do the apology? Oh. This gotta be Patreon. This is hilarious, niggas. How I do it? Patreon. This is so Patreon. Damn, Damn son. Backslash, more than culture. More than culture is the brand. It's the more than culture show. Come on, the secret genius, Remo Ride, Tyler Chronicles. Ronnie Jordan is not here. Sydney Castillo is. We are. Love you, Ronnie. <laughs>